Ezra. I'm sorry, I almost forgot, so I'm gonna do a little, I'm really gonna do a little bit of editing after I'm done with this, because I haven't done that for a while. Alright, so your question was, what is your favorite, essentially, what is your favorite Shakespeare anything? I'm kind of a horrible person. I haven't read a lot of the plays, but I've been able to see, like, different renditions of them, so I think I saw Two Gentlemen of Verona, and that was pretty funny, but they put, like, a... I think they said in like the 50s or 60s or something, so I like that little spin on it, but yeah, I like that, and I, I saw Macbeth at the Guthrie as well, and that was also really good. So I, so I'm going to say um, Two Gentlemen, Macbeth, and also Hamlet, just because it's awesome. I'm not going to say Romeo and Juliet, though, because like after reading the other ones and like seeing them, um, I appreciate those ones more than Romeo and Juliet just because that one's just so I don't know predictable so well known um my question for you is if you could have any kind of pet like whether it's legal to have them in the US or as a house pet or not what would it be um I think my answer would be maybe a chinchilla since they have chinchilla dust left over from Sullivan, it's how you bathe them. It's really fun. Um, I don't know. I guess I'm very limited in what I would have for pets. I know I want to get a chocolate lab eventually, but I'm pretty basic. I don't think I'd get anything too outlandish. I could be the next Mr. Popper and like have a whole bunch of penguins in my house. That'd be kind of fun, but it'd be really chilly, I think. So anyway, what is your answer to this? As for your punishment, I think instead of thinking of two because that's too hard, I'm just going to give you one and that'll like atone for everything. So um, I actually gave this to you last week, but I forgot to say it, so I like I put annotations in it. So um, I'll say it this time. So your punishment is to vlog about any awkward topic of your choice. And the one thing I ask of you is you have to vlog about it in a public area. So it'll be a challenge in and of itself, so that's why I'm not going to be too mean and like give you two different punishments. So I wish you luck, and I'm still really scared to see what kind of challenge you give me. So anyway, I'm going to keep this really, really short, and I'll see you online Thursday, and hopefully in real life next Tuesday, I think it is, when we hopefully make cookies, but I still have to hear from Avery and Laura about whether they can do it or not. If not, it'll just be you, Rosemary, and me will make cookies, and it'll be good fun. Alright, I'll see you later. Bye!